Hi, welcome to the GFI Labs Malware Minute. My name is Tom Kelschner. The GFI Labs researchers found a new rogue security product this week. Antivirus Solution 2010 is the latest rogue in the Unvirix family. Analyst Adam Thomas also came across some search engine optimization poisoning with a seasonal theme over the weekend. The scam tried to hook web users searching for pumpkin or jack-o'-lantern stencils. By Monday morning, most of the malicious sites had been taken down. The poison links went to sites that tried to install the fake vines rogue. And in an earlier SEO poisoning, we found links that popped up from a search for Vanessa Huggins No Clothes and led to a PDF file exploit that Viber detects as exploit.pdf-js.gen. It poses as an Adobe update in this case. Out-of-date versions of Adobe Reader are, are vulnerable. The latest version, which is 9.4, is not vulnerable, so check for updates if you use Reader. We discovered an interesting feature of the ThinkPoint Rogue from two weeks ago. Its graphic interface actually has an operating settings selection with a drop-down box that includes a checkbox called Allow Unprotected Startup. The Rogue locks up your machine on the pretense that it's protecting you, but you can close it and load your desktop once the box has been checked. From there, you can use Windows Task Manager to stop hotfix.exe, which is the Rogue's main file. During the week, Alex Eckleberry came across some mobile me phishing. It was a phishing email aimed at mobile me subscribers. It contained a link that led to a malicious site that was intended to look like the Apple Store. You don't want to bite on that Apple, though. It'll snatch your credit card information.